Hey, my name is Glenn Vickery. Welcome to my YouTube channel, Kiwi Bushcraft and Survival. And today I'm going to be covering another tree, one of my, another favourite of mine, called um, Karamu, or basically of the Comprosma um, family. Um, so this one here is uh, Karamu. There's about five different um, versions of, of this um, plant or uh, young or small tree and um, they have leaves that are opposite okay and um, you can see here this is the leaves they're quite scraggly um, plants you know they're not very nice looking uh, leaves they always seem to be scraggly but um, how you can recognize them they've got heaps of berries heaps of berries here we go here these all are green ones okay and they're just everywhere and these grow off the stems as well okay um, the green ones are unripe uh, most things that are green are generally unripe of the berries okay when they start getting ripe they go orange okay the, here's a here's an orange one right there okay when they start going orange they, they are ripe okay so um, what we'll do is um, I'll try and there's not many ripe ones on here on this particular tree um, but there's one down in here try and zoom in on it a bit I'll try and get a bit better zoom okay so there's a uh, there's a ripe one in there okay and um, this tree here is actually uh, um, associated or related to the coffee tree okay and the coffee tree obviously we all know what coffee is um, and the seeds of the coffee tree uh, the raw seeds of the coffee tree are quite well known these days now as um, uh, you know they burn fat quite quickly uh, so the raw seeds all right so and people pay quite a bit of money for it so I'm guessing that these may have a good chance of actually doing doing the same all right so what I'll do is I'll take this one here off. Now when it's in season, okay, um, when it's in season, these berries, um, this whole tree will just be full of them, okay. So if you're, if you're looking for a, a good bush feed, then um, that's what you want, okay. Alright, um, I, I generally eat the seeds and all, some people... Um, um, friends and family that I've uh, introduced these to uh, they spit the seeds out but uh, I, I eat the seeds and some some eat the seeds um, because there's a chance that uh, they could be good for fat burning they're harmless anyway so um, anyway uh, I'll show you I'll just bring this back a bit okay and I'll bring it around okay and you can see the uh, berry okay some very juicy um, the flesh is um, very soft and juicy um, and I'll see if I can get the seeds out All right. here's the seeds here okay and you can probably see some of the flesh All right so a couple of white white seeds and um, you can see some of the flesh there as well all right I'll zoom in a, I'll zoom in a bit more there we go okay so there's the flesh the red orangey flesh and the uh, white seeds okay and i just eat the whole lot you know so um don't. okay so um i don't like to waste any of it um yeah so um one of my favourites, as I said, because you get such a good feed from it, uh, nice and juicy, and you can eat them pretty much all day uh, with no problems. So, karamu, uh, one of my favourites. Um, if you see this around, you'll see them. They'll just be orange um, berries all over it, okay? Um, so, if you look at this tree here, come back a bit, all right? There's the tree there. Okay, we'll zoom in a bit. Alright, and you can see, let's try and pick up the berries. 
Okay, there's the berries there. Alright, they're just everywhere. All over it. And I come down here in um, about uh, end of December. Okay, around about beginning of, in, beginning of December to mid-December. Okay, and there's another tree just over here. Alright. And these are just covered in berries. Okay. You can see another another green one just down there. Or, or another sorry orange one. Okay, just fantastic. Okay, so for commercial use, um, somebody in the past did did say that it could be used for making coffee. Apparently, the coffee uh, is not that great, but as far as a um, fat burning, um, you know, fat burning. Um, and crushing the uh, seeds into a powder and making a powder form um, it could have um, huge potential absolutely huge potential so um, I'm not a chemist or anything but somebody that is um, could probably look into that and, and uh, it could be huge because they just yeah grow heaps and heaps of um, berries anyway um, we'll move on uh, to the next uh, tree or shrub and um, like subscribe and share and uh, please make comments and um, if you've got any you know any questions at all just um, just ask me and um, I'll do my best to um, help you um, thank you for coming along cheers